Hey guys, so I have a haul video for you today. Um, it's Black Friday stuff as well as some online orders I placed. It's all kind of jumbled into one. Um, I'm filming on my mom's camera right now, so I'm kind of testing out to see like quality differences and stuff. So hopefully, and there's a viewfinder, which I've never had before. So if I look up, um, now I understand why people do that because it's very tempting to just keep staring there. Anyway, I'm just testing this out for funsies because I'm at home right now. So let's get started. All right, if you saw my last haul video, you know that I had a sale event going on with Shop Lately, but that has now ended. And the couple of the pieces actually I didn't get in time to show in that video that were a part of my sale. I hope some of you guys uh, were able to get them. But it's this necklace right here. These are both from AO Styles. Um, and this is just a basic antique gold uh, necklace with some dangly things on the bottom here and then I also got this pair of earrings they may look a little familiar if you've watched all of my haul videos <laughs> this is the same as those bluish goldish uh, Druzy earrings this is just like the charcoaly gray version of them and I love Druzy so I had to get another color so there's that as always please check out shoplately.com I love this website and I've been collaborating with them for like over a year definitely over a year maybe even two at this point i just really like the site and i highly recommend it if you're looking for any kind of accessories or clothing or whatever they have everything next up i have some stuff from toby.com and they wrote me this really cute little note on here it says dear katie here are some gifts for you we hope you enjoy these pieces as we can't wait to see how you'll style them happy holidays from all of us here at toby and many thanks for being a part of our blogger community much love toby community team so I just thought that was cute. I like when people personalize things. So anyway, so I did get a couple things kind of geared towards the holidays. The first thing is this deep uh, olive green skirt here. It has buttons down the front and it also has pockets, which is awesome. And it has some thin belt loops if you want to do that. But that is a car. <laughs> this is the other holiday-esque piece that I picked out. It is a big red tunic and it's very thin. You can wear it off the shoulders and I really liked how they styled it on the website the girl was wearing um like a black beanie and a black like cami tank under it and she had this worn off the shoulder it looked kind of like holiday bohemian <laughs> it was very cool so i got this because she looked good in it okay next up i got this dress that i i thought was very unique i've never seen anything quite like it so it looks like a crop uh and skirt duo but it has like this mesh insert in the middle. I don't know if you guys can see that. It has some boning to it as well. And then it has a mesh insert up here. This is not showing it well, but there it is up there. It's really cool. Um, I do feel like it is a little bit much for me. I, did, I didn't expect it to be so much fabric because I'm just, I'm small and I'm short. So, but I do really like it. It's a very cool piece. So there is that dress. Next up, I got this crop top and it has really cool, uh, a really cool neckline to it. So it has this rectangular, okay, <laughs> rectangular cut out in the front and it has these big, thick um, straps. So that's really all I have to say about that. Lastly is my favorite piece. I'm really excited about this one and I'm really glad that I got it. It is very vibrant and neon and I love it. And there are so many white cars driving by. It's like literally like the 10th white car and I do not know who I just waved at. <laughs> but it looks like this and it has a nude um, bottom to kind of balance out the crazy uh, neonness. Now there were other colors, but I had to go with my highlighter yellow. This is where it's at. Thank you uh, to Toby, because uh, th that's cool. <laughs> okay, just, we're jumbling it out. All right, I placed an online Forever 21 order on Black Friday. I got this purse. It's a backpack purse. Now I know my mom is totally gonna laugh and make fun of me because I've always laughed and made fun of her for her backpack purses. So it's kind of biting me in the butt right now. But I love it. This one's a cool one, right? It's it's not mom-ish. It's, it's cool, <laughs> sort of. It has some cool silver hardware. It was originally $32.90 and I think I got it for less than 20, I think, um, with all the discounts and stuff. So there is that one. The only clothing item I got when I purchased online was just this striped t-shirt. It's really, it's like a tunic. I could possibly wear it as a dress. It's a little bit short. I'll probably throw on some shorts with it and some knee high socks. I'm guessing that's how I'm gonna style it. This was $12.90, it was a medium and it's pretty thin. It's actually very sheer. So we're gonna have to deal with that. <laughs> the other things I bought online, I got one pair of earrings and these are really cool. I'm really into this style. I don't know what it's called, but it goes into your piercing and it hooks up kind of like an ear cuff a little bit higher up. These are definitely statement makers and I really love them. I did try these on, they're not the most comfortable to be honest, but 
I just love this style and I will do with it because they're pretty. These were $5.90. And lastly for my online order, I did get this neck or not necklace, bracelet. I haven't purchased a bracelet in forever and it's just a burnished silver, um, matches all the jewelry that I'm wearing right now, but it's just a kind of a boho looking piece. And I did see this in store and I was like, you know what, I'm gonna use my discount and buy it online. So there was that. This was $8.90. Now I did make a few purchases in store from Forever 21, uh, some more jewelry things just over the course of a couple or not a couple months maybe a month and I did get this set of ear cuffs there were five in here for $5.90 which I thought was a really good what is your deal and they're just silver ones some of them have like gems and whatnot on them so oh dear don't fall off <laughs> so there's that I got a silver ring and this is a really cool one and it has like this claw on it so you could wear it this way or you could also wear it this way. I'm honestly not sure which way I like more, but it's just a really cool piece. So I got that ring and it was $3.90. I got another set of earrings and this, they have, okay. I got them for the same reason that the other ones, they kind of go like this. This one doesn't have any sort of cuff to secure it though. So these don't really work very well. Like they, they kind of droop, which looks really ridiculous and not good at all. So I don't know about these. They were $4.90, but I bought them when they were on sale. So I, eh, I don't know, we'll see. And the last thing is this burnished gold necklace. It has these, oh dear. It has these dangly gold triangles at the bottom. So that's just pretty basic. And this was $4.90 if I didn't say that already. I also bought another pair of their $7.90 uh, denim and I got the black pair, another one. And I bought these because I distressed my first pair. I bought them for that purpose. And they're, I got them in a 26. I got this one in a 25 because the other one tends to stretch out uh, throughout the day as a lot of denim does. So I figured I would size down and see how these work, so. There is that. I bought a pair of printed pants from Foreign Exchange. You guys know I love my printed shorts, but it, it looks a little ridiculous to wear them now that it's colder. So I got this pair and they're kind of like harem pants, but not really. They're just kind of these baggy, super comfortable, like so comfortable, like more comfortable than pajamas if that's possible. That's a thing now. It looks really nice. I do like the fact that it has some extra fabric gathering at the top. Okay, literally every car that's passed by has been white. Like, I don't know what is happening right now. These were 22, but I think they were like 30% off or something. All right, so let's move on to the stuff that I actually bought on Black Friday. There's only, there's not as much as you would expect. Okay, that could be a lie. There's a black car, there's a black car. First one. I did go to the body shop and they were having a 3 for 33 sale and I saved two of the items to be or for Christmas but I could not separate myself from this. So this is the little glazed apple eau de toilette. It's one of their limited edition holiday scents and I've been wearing this nearly every day since I got it. In Forever 21 the guy was like you smell like Kool-Aid. <laughs> Really? I was like, I don't, I thought I smelled like nerds. It smells like nerds to me, but then my friend also told me that I smelled like Kool-Aid. I think it smells like nerds. Either way, it smells like nerds rope to me, like 100%. So I'm down with that. This is freaking amazing. So there is that. I got a bunch of stuff from Bath and Body Works. I went a couple times and I think they were like buy three, get three free. I think that was the Black Friday deal. Okay, let's get rid of that. So the first time I went, I just bought um, six of the pocket backs because it made more sense to do it separately because if you always get the cheaper items free, you know how that goes. So I only have four here because one I gave to my grandpa and one is in my purse. So, but I have duos of them so you get to see them anyway and there's really no reason for me to be telling you all this. The one that's in my purse is the I Heart Mustache one and it's pomegranate scented. I usually try to steer clear of things that aren't like citrus scented but I just it has a mustache and I had to get it because my dad has a mustache and he always thinks it's funny. So <laughs> there's my explanation for that one. Not that you needed one. The next thing is fresh sparkling snow. I did get another one of these. That's what my grandpa has. And I got some other stuff in this scent as well. The other two scents that I got are Candy Cane Bliss, which you can guess what that one smells like. Now this one has glitter in it, which I am not a fan of, but it's, it's for the holidays. Let's just be merry and Right. <laughs> the other one is Kiss Kiss Mistletoe, and I just looked at this, and I don't remember grabbing this. Like, I really don't. I don't even know what this smells like. 
it kind of smells like berry or something. Why did I get this? And it has glitter in it too. I don't, I really don't remember grabbing this and I'm thoroughly confused. And there is another white car. I don't know what's happening because there are no white cars on my street. <laughs> All right, so the other trip I made, I got a bunch of other things, mainly home scents. Uh, the one non-home scent thing that I got was this hand cream. This is the Raspberry Meringue Nourishing Hand Cream. I do like Bath & Body Works uh, hand creams. <laughs> I just said hand cream like five times. Now I did get four uh, wallflower bulbs. I go through these like crazy and I always just, I love these so much. I'm not a huge candle person anymore. I just find that using the wallflowers is like instant gratification. I don't have to worry about burning my house down or anything. So I did get two of my usuals. I got spiced apple toddy and leaves, but I got again this fresh sparkling snow. I think this is a new scent. At least it's new to me. So I did get two of those because um, it's just a really clean fresh scent. So I got that. Last item I purchased uh, in honor of my friend Amanda here on YouTube, Glam Mandy. If you haven't checked her out, you need to immediately. Immediately. I got sparkling icicles because this is her favorite scent from them and I decided to go for it. I got one item from the CCO and it is this roller ball. It is an, like a backup of the one that I already have. It's the DKNY Be Delicious and Be Delicious Fresh Blossom Duo and these are my two like all-time favorite perfumes, I guess you could say. If we're gonna go all serious about this. Um, so I just got a backup. I've never seen this at CCO, but I thought it was a Sephora exclusive. At least Sephora claimed it was a Sephora <laughs> exclusive, which it's a lie. It's all a lie. All right, and lastly, finally, to wrap up this haul is some stuff that I got from, oh, it's another, no, it's the same black car. So the stuff that I got from PacSun, uh, so I went in at like 11.45 and I like ran there and I had my dog in her backpack on my back and the sale ended at noon. It was 40% off like site or store wide I think and so I was like rushing and just grabbed some things and went to the counter and so I got this sweater. And it was honestly like an impulse buy. Like I said, I was just like grabbing things. I was like, I want to get it for sale. It was just, I don't know. I was a little bit ridiculous. I am so glad that I impulsively grabbed it for no apparent reason, but it's so warm. I love it. It's just amazing. So I just, I love it. I also got two pairs of jeans. They were buy one, get one free. So I got this pair. Uh, there were only two left and apparently it was a limited edition color, which is cool. These are super high rise, skinniest, and they're just a deep maroon burgundy color. The other pair of jeans I got uh, is another pair of distressed jeans, and these ones, the distressing goes quite high. It's a little scandalous, but these are actually from Gypsy Warrior, which is really cool that these were included in like the whole buy one get one free situation. And these are a little bit uh, more lightweight than my American Eagle ones too. So there is that. I want to give a shout out to the girl that I met in Pakistan, although she didn't tell me her name. She did tag me on Instagram in a picture that we took together, but then it, I think it's gone now. So I don't know how to find you or say what your name is, but thanks for coming up to me and sorry that I'm socially awkward. Oh, also to the girl in Forever 21. I think your name was Colleen. I think that was your name. Hello to you too. And again, sorry about my <laughs> awkwardness. I can't help it. It's, it's me. Okay. All right, so I think that is finally it for this haul video. I think that I covered everything, and thank you guys for watching. If you stuck through this entire thing, I applaud you. <laughs> wait, guys, wait. <laughs> I found one more thing in my bag, and I can't believe that I, I almost lost these. They're little, I think they're brontosaurus earrings. I just had to have them because they're adorable. Like, they're little baby dinosaurs. <laughs> like, I can't even deal with these. <laughs> like, they're just... They're so random, like I'm not even just like a dinosaur person by any means, but they're so cute and they were only 190. So I just had to, they're, they're freaking adorable. Okay, bye.